This is the second video in our series about our three-step process for securing your home or small business network with Firewalla. The first video, focused on visibility, is all about how you can get to know your entire network environment. Links to the other videos in this series are in the description below. After gaining a solid understanding of your network, the next step towards keeping your home or business safe is to set rules and policies. Your network belongs to you, so you should be the one to control it. Firewalla provides many ways to block, allow, and regulate traffic, helping you reduce the risk exposure of your network. Rules allow you to completely control what the devices on your network can and cannot access. Blocking rules restrict network access for one or more devices. You can block targets by domain, port, region, and more. You can also use rules to limit access to certain apps, such as YouTube or TikTok. For devices that are very purpose-specific and only need access to certain services, you can configure rules to only allow trusted connections to come through. For example, on your IoT devices, you can block all internet access, but only allow access to the ports they need. Your box offers an array of family-oriented features that make using the internet a safe and enjoyable experience for everyone. Family Protect blocks access to all websites with offensive content. We also offer Native Family Protect, which filters content locally and gives you full control over what to limit. Safe Search filters search results on various platforms, preventing you and your loved ones from seeing anything you don't want to see when using a search engine. Social Hour temporarily shuts down all social media usage on all devices for one hour so you can enjoy some quality family time. Firewalla also enables you to create multiple separate local networks in your home using network segmentation. Network segmentation is very powerful and can help you secure critical devices. For example, you can create a lockdown network for all your IoT devices and a guest network for visitors, preventing them from accessing your other devices in the case of a cyber attack. Another way to organize your network is to turn on new device quarantine, which immediately places unrecognized devices into a separate device group if they join your network. This way, you can have full visibility of unfamiliar devices and set special rules to control their access. If you worry about your IoT devices consuming too much bandwidth, you can easily prioritize traffic by either device or destination using Firewall's Smart Queue. Smart Queue monitors and dynamically manages bandwidth usage. Additionally, Firewall's policy-based routing allows you to send any device's network traffic to any destination you'd like, such as a third-party VPN server, a secondary WAN, or a site-to-site -site VPN. You can further tune your network experience by enabling Adblock. Besides preventing annoying advertisements from clogging your screen, Adblock also protects your privacy by preventing ads from tracking your online behavior. Another way to protect your privacy while browsing the web is to turn on DNS over HTTPS, also known as DOH, or turn on Unbound. DOH encrypts your DNS requests, and Unbound prevents a single public server from having all your DNS records. These services help stop third parties from spying on what websites, domains, and services your devices are accessing. You can also configure custom DNS entry rules to further adjust how your DNS traffic is interpreted. Firewalla gives you full power over your network, enabling you to limit access with rules and policies, make your network safe for everyone, create secure VLANs, quarantine new devices, manage and prioritize bandwidth, and protect your DNS traffic. Once your rules and policies are set and your devices are fully under control, you can start learning more about what Firewalla does in the background to protect you from data breaches and attacks. Watch the next video in this series, Protect, to see more.